the Coco Golf situation. Uh, beautiful girl, cute girl, uh, sweet girl. Uh, had to deal with some things. Trying to advance to the second round. Was down. Was coming back. And uh, then, you know, the other players trying to start uh, using tricks and playing slow. Coco's also from Atlanta, Georgia. But she's playing tennis. She's a bougie queen. We love our bougie queens. But the thing was, she wasn't getting treated fairly. And she had to advocate for herself. I had to yell at the ref. Uh, luckily, everybody could see. The crowd started cheering her on. And apparently, she waited a while. She tried to be patient. But then she was like, this, this is getting ridiculous. I mean, if auntie can't play, auntie need to get off the court. Like the other player wasn't supposed to be sitting. She just allowed her to sit on top of playing slow. It was just like, all right, so you're obviously getting your ass whipped and you're trying to slow the process down. Just uh, take your L like a woman. So a lot of black women are speaking up about it. It's like, this is what happens to us every day in corporate America. We have to speak up and then and then the other side just plays a victim because apparently the other girl started crying in the press coverage. They were treating me like I was a bad person, <laughs> which makes you more annoying. But Coco was like, I don't feel bad. Like I, I said what I need to say. I did it in a professional but, but stern way. And I think her coach was like telling her, like, yeah, go say something. So we're excited about her. This is the uh, new Serena. I think she beat Venus at like 15 years old. She's a prodigy. But she still doesn't know how to sh throw shade. They were like, <laughs> how was the match? She was like, slow. The Obamas were there. I think I think Michelle was probably like, Barack, get your ass up so we can go see Coco. All right. Let me just get my shirt, Michelle. And Michelle does that little dance. Beat her ass, Coco. Beat her ass. Yeah, everybody's taking Coco's side on this. Even the announcers were taking her side. Like, she's absolutely right. Like, I, I don't know why this judge... The judge was smirking like, I know you're beating her ass, but <laughs> I got to help her out. So I'm invested now. I'm like, I like Coco. <laughs> I'm about to be watching tennis. Maybe I should look up the tickets. It's in Queens. I might, I might go out there. <laughs> Get a Coco Puffs cereal box. <laughs> you know, <laughs> Cut out a picture, put her, put her face on it. Hold it up. Go, Coco. Go, Coco. When she swings her bat, it's like a Coco Rice Krispie. <laughs> Let me know what y'all think in the comments. I, I thought she did a good job and it was uh, unfortunate she had to go through all this. Also, we also have PTSD from Serena. They made it extra hard for Serena. You know, girls are competitive. Um, she's a minority in the sport. So, you know, they hate her. They don't want her to take over. So it's triggering for black people. We like, you messing with another one of our little sisters? <laughs> uh, so we got your back, Coco. We got you. Keep swinging.